Today, Apple refreshed the iMac lineup. I'm Skylar, and I'm going to tell you about it. Let's get started. So, Apple has been refreshing products. Yesterday, they refreshed two iPads. Today, the iMac. It's the same design, but it has upgrades to CPU and GPU. So, the basic idea is they've upgraded CPUs to i9s or i5s, and they have AMD Vega graphics. Now, so... There's been no design changes to the same iMacs. These are not the iMac Pro. Those have not been changed at all. The iMac, though, has had a redesign in the CPU-wise. So, on CPU-wise, there's two sizes still, same two sizes. There's this iMac, which is old, and then these new ones have been upgraded. So, this one has, and it appears to be an i3, but it's upgradable to be an i7. Graphics-wise, we have a Radeon Vega 55X. Again, this old one is Intel, but it's not one of the new ones. Con configurable up to a Vega 20. So, 2 to 4 gigs of VRAM on the smaller size. But if you go up to the bigger iMac, again, still just a 5K display on here. No physical redesign, just i5s up to i9s, and you also have a 570x up to a 48, 4 to 8 gigs of VRAM. So pricing st starts at $1,299 $1, on the new ones. There's an old one for $1,099. And pricing goes all the way up to $2,299 for the highest end one. So those are what you're seeing with the iMac lineup. But after Apple has refreshed that, and they also did products yesterday, we're wondering, will Apple do products tomorrow? There is a good chance that Apple will release products tomorrow. I'm thinking, and... We've also heard this from some sources, specifically a Mac Rumors report, that the iPod Touch 7 will be coming tomorrow. We're thinking it'll be the same design that's pictured right here, probably same prices or cheap, maybe a little cheaper, maybe a little bit more expensive. But yeah, if the Apple Store goes down tomorrow morning, <laughs> there will be reports of that. I might put something out on my Instagram. You can go follow me at real underscore iSkyler. And there will be information on there if Apple does this. So we may be seeing that tomorrow. So Apple this week has been preparing for that, their March 25th event, by releasing all this hardware so they can stick to software. So we'll have to see how the rest of this plays out. I'm iSkyler. Forgive my hiccups. Thank you for watching. Bye. <laughs>